everyone welcome again to my channel today's video is all about permutation and what about permutation it is the act of arranging the members or letters or objects of a set into a sequence or order and according to the theorem the number of permutations of n distinct objects is n factorial but take note that we can only use this theorem if the objects we are arranging are different from one another. Let us have this example. In how many ways can you arrange the letters A, B, and C together in a linear order? The answer is, there are six ways. How did we get the result? Let us use the three diagram. We can choose from A, B, or C. So we have here our first order, we have three choices. Now, if we take A, we only have two options. We can have B or C. If we take B, we can have C or A. If we take C, we can have A or B. This is our second order, and then therefore, we only have two choices. For the third order, we can choose C if we have A here and B. If we have A here and C, then we will have here B. If we have B, C, then A. B, A, then C. C, A, then B. C, B, then A. So this is our third order. We only have one choice. We're going to list all the possible arrangement. We can have here A, B, C. A, C, B. B, C, A. B, A, C. C, A, B. C, B, A. So there are six ways we can arrange the letters A, B, and C together in a linear order. Now, if we multiply all the choices in every order, this is equal to 3 times 2 times 1 is equal to 3 factorial ways. If we apply the fundamental counting principle, since we have 3 letters to be selected, we will create or draw 3 lines. On the first line, we have 3 options. We can choose from A, B, or C. Say for example, if we take A here, then we only have 2 options here. We can have B or C only. If we take A here, and we have here B, and therefore, we only have one option on the last slot, and that is C. Multiplying all the given options, we arrive on six ways. Now remember that the number of permutations of n distinct objects is n factorial. So if we have n is equal to 3, then therefore the permutation is equal to n factorial, and that is equal to P is equal to 3 factorial, and that is equal to six ways thank you for watching and learning with me till next videos